Now we are going to make the companion stitch to the twin stitch knit, which is the twin stitch purl. We again have the working yarn yellow. We have the row we're working into is the green, and the rest of the work is white below that. So to make the twin stitch purl, first we are going to take the stitch we're going to work into, which is this one, move it to the right needle. Now we're going to use the left needle tip to lift that collar stitch, which is the one that wraps around the working stitch, and place it next to the working stitch but do not take the needle tip out. Leave the needle tip in. Now we're going to take the working yarn and purl that lifted stitch. And now you can see we have the green stitch we're working into and the yellow stitch with our working yarn both going through that loop below. Now we're going to move that completed twin stitch purl onto the left needle and then we are ready to turn our work and we have the made stitch on the right needle properly oriented and we are just going to continue knitting our short row as usual and then I want to show you how once we come back to that twin stitch we're going to get rid of it. So just pretend I made another stitch in that direction there, which I did not do. Purl all the way to the stitch that you've made and you can see you have two stitches through one collar stitch. From here on out, we always treat this as though it were a single purl stitch. Ignore the fact that there's a twin stitch there. And when the directions tell you to purl the, the twin stitch purl, just do it. Just like that. And then you can continue purling and you are done.